Metro home builders call it a crisis. Affordable housing getting tougher to find in the Kansas City region. I, and tonight a new study is pointing to reasons behind the shortfall. Fox 4's Sean McDowell has more from local construction leaders and an elected official who believes he can help. We should start operating with a sense of urgency. It's getting tougher to find a home in the Kansas City Metro. A new study from the Mid-America Regional Council says this area is now 24,000 housing units short in part because of a big shortfall in new builds. And we should not allow housing to become subordinate to some other priority. Will Reuter leads the Home Builders Association of Greater Kansas City, a group that fosters construction projects. Reuter says changes to construction codes in Kansas City, Missouri have pushed developers into leaving the show me state to go to the Kansas side of the metro. Reuter says slowdowns in construction are often due to not having enough lots or land to build new homes. He's seen instances where not enough labor was available to build or insufficient money from lending institutions. Reuter believes local law should be changed to encourage more building. We don't have the housing market today because of one policy decision or one market dynamic. It's, a, it's an aggregate of all of those things over the decades. So we need to start taking the steps now to improve those conditions. One proposed ordinance intends to help matters in Kansas City, Missouri. If we're serious about addressing our housing crisis, we need to take away barriers. Second District Council member Wes Rogers is proposing changes to the city's energy code. He believes changes from 2021 have caused developers to shy away. Those changes were meant to make new houses ready for electric vehicles and the roofs to be ready for solar panels. He says his proposal would remain environmentally friendly. Housing is the number one priority in our city. It needs to stay the number one priority. And the solution is all of the above, whatever we can do to build more housing. Councilman Rogers says even with his proposed changes, Kansas City's Municipal Energy Code would still remain the toughest of its kind in our metro. The Home Builders Association supports that move. Reuter says there's no reason builders can't support the environment and still produce. Sean McDowell, Fox 4, working for you.